guys, so let's talk about how you can find a profitable affiliate niche to specialize in because just throwing content on the internet is not always going to work. Look at me just throwing imaginary stuff in the air. Anyways, let's jump into it. So we're going to talk about how you can utilize AI to find a profitable affiliate niche to specialize in, do proper keyword research and things like that because making content takes a lot of time and effort. So you really want to make sure that you are getting the right return on investment. If you've seen my Pinterest affiliate marketing video, you probably know that I've tried doing the whole, let me just put a lot of pins and content out there and um, that didn't really work. So because of that, we need to do proper keyword research. And by the way, you can use this strategy on all kinds of platforms, including Pinterest, Medium, YouTube, your own affiliate marketing, blog, TikTok, you name it. And so in today's video, we're going to be using this tool called SEORocket.ai, which is a newer affordable keyword research tool, which I've been really enjoying so far. So let's talk about how exactly this works. So when it comes to doing keyword research, you always want to start with trying to figure out which platform you want to specialize in. So for example, if you're looking to make affiliate income on Pinterest, I've previously showed how you can do in-depth research on like Pinterest trends to see what is even trending to help you kind of sort of narrow down the niche. So let's just say for today's purposes, we are going to focus on pickleball as a niche because we all know it's been a very, very popular sport here in North America. So once you figure that part out, you can go to SEO Rocket, which has multiple keyword research tools. So we're going to start with related keywords. This function is really going to help you identify those long tail keywords because obviously just ranking for the keyword pickleball would be very difficult since it's so broad and there's just so much competition. Here's what we're going to do. And we're just going to type it in. The cool thing is that you can also choose the country that you base out of or the country that you're trying to target for affiliate income. So I'm just going to pick the United States, which is where I am based out of. So let's click here. All right, awesome. So let's look at this. So when we're starting with something as broad as the keyword pickleball, you're obviously going to get a ton of results. But as you notice, some of the popular related keywords are going to be pickleball chords, pickleball chord, pickleball chords near me. And then you can also look at things like keyword difficulty, which means like how hard would it be for you to rank for that keyword based on things like the competition, search volume and things like that. Based on what I'm seeing right now, it looks Looks like pickleball cord related topic is going to be a pretty good one to rank for. Okay, so I guess pickleball cord it is. Now let's quickly go on Amazon and see what we can find. So it looks like there are actually quite a few products within the pickleball cord niche. It looks like there are some portable pickleball cords, there are some permanent, temporary ones, there's tape that you can use to create your own pickleball cord. And I like that a lot of these products are within that healthy price range. So it looks like high 90s, low 100s. So it seems like there are actually quite a few products that we can promote. Oh, and by the way, don't forget to follow me on Instagram because I would love to be friends. So the next function that I wanted to show you is called cluster research, which pretty much helps you to discover related topics and subtopics by entering your main keyword. So pretty much what a keyword cluster can really help you with is you can figure out what it is that people are searching around you or like what some of the problems that your potential customers are facing right now and searching for. So that way you can really cover the topic in depth and provide specific solutions with your content, which will hopefully attract more of that organic traffic. Okay, cool. So let's look at this. Here are all the different keyword clusters so a lot of related keywords to this topic. So we're going to actually click on on pickleball courts since that is the exact match. So first of all, here's kind of what you can learn more about. So the keyword difficulty is 14, which is actually pretty low. Estimated traffic is quite a bit. And then this is the monthly search volume. This is actually quite high. So to me, it looks like a lot of the searches revolve around how to construct a pickleball court, such as pickleball dimensions. What is the cheapest way to create a pickleball court, pickleball court construction. So it looks like there's a pretty real demand and for creating a pickleball cord, which is good because we found a lot of products that would solve that problem. So this keyword cluster is also a really great way to validate this topic. So it looks like there's actually quite a bit of search volume and demand for this type of keyword and this type of niche, which is great. 
So you're telling me there's a chance. So the next thing that I really like about this tool is that they have the AI writer that will literally help you to generate an AI article based on this topic that you have found. Cool. So with the AI writer, there are actually a lot of different functions that are a little bit more sophisticated than let's just say like free tools like ChatGPT. So there are quite a few options when it comes to creating your article. You can do it manually. You can do AI assisted writing. And they also have this really interesting function to where you can pretty much create an article based on the keywords from your main competitors. And by main competitors, I mean other websites that cover similar topics, which is very sneaky, but I like it. That is if you want to create your article manually, because I know a lot of people like to write their own content, so you can just create an outline to help you with writing. Now let's go with the first option, which is creating an outline. And if you look at this, this is actually a very detailed outline. It pretty much gives you all the suggestions on like the structure, topics that you want to cover. So they do pretty in-depth research and give some pretty valuable suggestions to you. I'm noticing that one of the things that they're suggesting here is to include the standard dimensions for pickleball court. Just a reminder, that's one of the problems that we notice a lot of people are trying to solve like slash searching for, which is really good to know. So that will really help you with your keyword ranking. All right, standard dimensions, key markers and things like like that, that is actually a pretty detailed outline, if you can tell. Let's just say if you're like me and you're not a very good writer, especially if English is like not your first language, same here. What you can also do is that you can, you guessed it, outsource this to AI. So we're gonna go and we're going to click on AI assisted writing. So you can create this for three credits. So let's do this. A few moments later. All right, so let's look at the first draft that SEO Rocket came up with. Okay, so it looks like the very top we have the table of contents. There's actually quite a bit that they include, and it's very detailed. All right, from backyard farm to global phenomenon, the rise of pickleball, so it just gives you a little bit of like pickleball history. And then it just gives you all the dimensions that people are looking for, which again is going to be very helpful. It looks like it's telling you to include some sort of illustration in here, which is also a very great part where you can like insert the actual like pickleball court, like the product itself. So it would be good for affiliate marketing. Okay, so let's look at this next part, which is actually very interesting. So the first draft that we just receive that doesn't have the highest score and the score is based on the article's quality and relevance so you ideally want to aim for at least 50 which is average and then 70 would be the top one of the main things that influences the score is the keywords that you are using and adding more keywords will increase the score. Let's say you want to kind of make it a little bit more specialized and create an affiliate article specifically targeted towards people in New York City. So what you can do is we can find this keyword, which is Pickleball Courts NYC. And what you can do is you can either generate a sentence, a whole paragraph or a heading. So let's try to do actually just a sentence to make it a little bit quicker. Let's do this one and we can click insert and then it raised the score a little bit. So let's say if you want this article to really focus on courts, you can do that, but you can also do related products such as pickleball paddles. So you can continue inserting. You can pretty much keep adding all of these keywords until you reach at least 50. So it's a good opportunity for you to like customize everything if you want to. And pretty much all you need to do is to incorporate these products within your articles. Now, once you're ready, you can hit publish and you can publish it directly to your WordPress website, which which is really awesome. You could do it on Webflow, download as HTML, save and things like that. So last but not least, let's talk about the topical map function which is really also going to help you to find some of the subtopics or some of the other areas of, let's say, like pickleball or whatever it is, the niche that you want to find. And that will can also give you ideas of, on like the titles or any of the other topics that you might want to cover within this niche. So we are going to do this pickleball court and create a topical map. OK, whoever is the copywriter, they're pretty funny. Embrace yourself. Keywords are coming. All right. So let's look at our pickleball courts topical map which pretty much gives you a ton of different article ideas based on what people are searching and some of the relevant keywords and topics. So it looks like one of the ideas could be discover pickleball courts available near you today, find the best pickleball locations close to you, choosing the right pickleball paddles for your game, 
and you can select the topics visualization to see it in this kind of format. So the reason why I like this topical map function is because when it comes to any content creation or any niche or anything like that, you always want to make sure that you have like as many topics as possible, right? Because you can't just like again, create one piece of content and expect it to like generate income for you forever. Oh my God, why? Sometimes it does happen. But in general, if you really want to grow in this niche, you constantly have to come up with more and more ideas. And there's only like so much that you can say about like, let's say pickleball courts. And there's so only so many different products but a function like this will help you to generate more and more ideas see what else people are looking for within the pickleball niche to help you continue making more content and yeah that's pretty much some of the key functions that I wanted to show you guys today inside of this tool that I recently discovered there are also a lot of other functions such as content audit if you already have like an existing website there are just reports automations humanizer and this is still a new and growing tool so if you have any additional feature requests so you can make those as well. Yeah, and that is pretty much it. So as you can see, a tool like SEO Rocket.ai is a pretty in-depth tool. I feel like there are a lot of different features that I find personally very helpful, which is why I'm also glad that they have decided to partner with me in this video. So if you're interested in checking out SEO Rocket.ai, make sure to use my link down below. The good news is that this tool is currently very affordable and you can purchase it on AppSumo. If you've never heard of AppSumo before, it is an awesome platform if you're looking for new software and tools for you on a budget because AppSumo actually allows you to purchase a lifetime access to different tools that can really help you to grow and scale your business. They have so many different things within like the finance, marketing, SEO, all kinds of niches. You can find all kinds of software and tools to help you with your entrepreneurial or content creation adventures. And you can just pay a one-time fee and just have access to that tool pretty much forever. So if you're interested, make sure to check check them out down below. Um, yeah, and that is pretty much it for me today, guys. So this is one of the strategies that I feel like has really helped me recently with my affiliate marketing strategy. Still working in a lot of more affiliate marketing videos because it seems like you guys really like them. So if that's true and you still want to see more affiliate marketing related videos, make sure to let me know in the comments down below and, and hit that like button. And if you like this video, I actually think you're going to like this one as well. So yeah, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Bye.